ladies and gentlemen, we're back for some more PCW! We're back in the arena and everyone's ready for this show. And it's still called PCW because we are the biggest con in wrestling. I'm RNA5, welcome back to the show. Week 4 is here, we just caught a massive baby view here in Cologne, Germany. And we're ready to see what's in store for us on PCW television tonight. Come tonight, we have a huge event off the back of Money in the Bank. We know our champions now. And one of our champions are in action later on tonight against a certain Mr. Money in the Bank. Daniel Bryan takes an ass of black later on here tonight. We know that match is happening right here tonight. And our main event of the evening, Stone Cold Steve Austin has called out anybody. He won their main event, son. And it's been answered, but we'll find out who has answered that challenge later on tonight. Let's just get into this contest right here right now. You know, I'm ready. I'm ready for this. Let's get into this right here right now. This show is about to get crazy. We just come off a big pay-per-view. Let's see what's going to happen in uh, this event here tonight. We're ready for action here and oh, we're just kicking off right off the bat. Rey Mysterio and Cedric Alexander both in the ring. No official in the ring. We're just having a big old brawl here inside the squared circle. It seems that is the case. These two were due to compete at Money in the Bank, but Rey Mysterio opted not to face Cedric Alexander, instead taking him out early on. And now Cedric Alexander looking for revenge. Rey Mysterio making his singles debut here as Cedric Alexander. Big clothesline there from Cedric Alexander. An unsanctioned brawl here between these two. Not a light suplex from Mysterio. The bell is wrong. This wasn't an official contest between these two here. Rey Mysterio kicked to the back to Cedric Alexander. Both starting this off inside the ring. And big step up into Guri from Rey Mysterio. This is just a big old brawl between these two. Look at this. Rey Mysterio go for a suplex. Oh, looking for the three amigos. Shout out to Eddie Guerrero. Boom. And the crowd counting along one more time. The three amigos. He's calling for it. Cedric Alexander trying to pull himself up on the ropes there. Big kick from Rey Mysterio. And this is this is a rivalry between these two men who've... Oh, they're throwing him to the outside. That was vicious as well. Look at Rey Mysterio. What's he going for here? Rey Mysterio. Oh! Double bootsies. Using his boots to his advantage there. You saw that from Rey Mysterio. Very big move. And oh, into the steps go Cedric Alexander. Rey Mysterio not having this tonight. He doesn't want to deal with Alexander once again. Cedric Alexander, though, look at this. Catches him, exploder. Oh, beautifully done from Cedric Alexander. And look at that. Taunting away is Cedric Alexander after that one big move he's landed. Look at Mysterio. Do not turn your back. Rey Mysterio, because you get into the steps. Somehow managed to get on that side of the steps. We'll take that, Rey Mysterio. Oh, reversal from Cedric Alexander, though. It's just a... Flat out brawl. There's no official to, to calm things down. We're letting these two go out of here. And the fans are loving it. Big forearm from Cedric Alexander. But Rey Mysterio. Look at this. Whoop. Twirl the world Hurricane Rana. But Cedric's back up. A kip up to his feet. And oh, in the steps goes Mysterio. Cedric and Mysterio going back and forth here. Cedric Alexander getting more offense as the match goes on. And Alexander throwing Rey Mysterio across the other side. Of the outside, and Alexander not having that, he's just step back inside the ring. Oh, he's going back out, Shai Shai. Oh, wait a minute, Mysterio chasing him down. Look at this, throws him back in those steps, near those steps anyway. Rey Mysterio. Loving the energy from the crowd here. Big kick from Mysterio, and now Rey Mysterio. Again, puts him into steel steps. He came off a, a loss in that Money in the Bank match. It was won by Alistair Black. We'll see him later on tonight, of course. He was involved in that match. Shai Shai was not... Mysterio back in the ring. He puts Cedric Alexander. What has he got in store for Cedric Alexander? And look at this. Oh, puts him on the ropes. He's about to dial it up, son. Look out. No, he's not. I thought he was dialing it up. I thought he was going to call 619. Did not go for it. And look at this, Mysterio, though. Whoop. This could be it, though. He's calling. He's dialing it up. Dialing it up for 619. Ray Mysterio's. Got back, gets back in the ring. And even though it's been taking place in the ring, there's no official to counter pin or submission. This might be a knockout. 
sort of matchup here, style matchup, we have to win by knockout. For both, this is just a flat out brawl, we had no idea these two would compete again tonight. So this might be not officially counted onto the records, but it's been a good showing from Rey Mysterio thus far. Big punch from Cedric Alexander, throws Mysterio in the steps again. Alexander may have taken a beating, but he's not going down without a fight. Saying he's number one. Big chop to the head of Mysterio now. Picks him back up. Big Lariat kip up from Cedric Alexander. Cedric Alexander go for that neck crank. Fans watching on here from the outside. The ones that are close by are getting a good view of Cedric Alexander Rey Mysterio here. Look at this. Rey Mysterio reverses now. Throws him to the other side of the outside area here. Rey Mysterio grabs him. Look at this. Oh, little Frankensteiner from Rey Mysterio. Mysterio now up. He throw back into the ring by Alexander. Big chance for Sergio Alexander here to get some momentum here. Maybe get some moves going. Look at this. Oh, bloody hell. Dr nice little dragon style suplex. Sergio Alexander loved that. So that was a good one. Cedric Alexander now puts him into the ropes. Is he going for a 6 one himself? Oh, he's doing a little taunting. Look at Mysterio. He's shaking. And now Cedric Alexander. Oh, look at that. The bottom rope caught Mysterio's arm somehow. And look at that. Alexander. Double lariat. In the corner. Big old lariat in the corner. And now Alexander runs to the ropes. Ducks under. What's he going for here? Big lariat again. Kip up. Cedric Alexander's on fire, people. Cedric Alexander trying to do stuff here. Look at this. Oh, boom! Face Buster. Cedric Alexander maybe going for the killing blow. Is he going for that lumbar check? We know Cedric Alexander can do it. Here it is. Lumbar check. And Cedric Alexander, I think, has knocked out Rey Mysterio. The graphics say he's won. Uh, he does look like that. Here's some highlights. Rey Mysterio. Nailing a 619. We well, don't have to put away Cedric Alexander. This was the beginning of the end for Mysterio. That face buster move. And then Cedric Alexander was lining him up. And making sure his lumbar was in check. And it certainly was here. Here is your winner, Cedric Alexander. Cedric Alexander gets some revenge from Money in the Bank. Rey Mysterio. Has pie all over his mask after this match. Well, not after this matchup, but this brawl tonight. Cedric Alexander, big, I guess, win, we'll say. That feels like a win for him. Cedric Alexander feeling good after that matchup. Very good brawl. We'll see what happens between these two in the future. But for now, Cedric Alexander looks pretty good after this brawl between Rey Mysterio. For your company. Well, anyway, now let's move swiftly on to our first actual match of the evening. Oh, here we go. The boys are back in town. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 576 pounds, Mark Henry. The boys are back in town. The tag team division is alive once again. Heath Slater and Mark Henry, the boys, back in action for the first time since that defeat to the Lucha Bros, who, of course, are now our new tag team champions. The boys looking to get back on top here, looking to get into that tag team number one contendership that is currently vacate at, vacant at the moment. So the boys could be in line for a shot in the near future. But first, they'll have to take care of business with DIY. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 400 pounds, Tomaso Champa and Johnny Gargano DIY. DIY back together again, coming off a loss from their last effort here in BCW. But a win here will definitely put them in the mix for that tag team title shot. 
As that's actually against the boys who have a win over the Tag Team Champions, by the way. Uh, he played a Mark Henry. So, DIY will look to get the job done here tonight and put themselves in that contender spot. As the division is wide open currently with that Lucha Bros Tag Team title victory. Will DIY get a job in here tonight? We're about to find out as we kick off our first official match of the evening. So Mark Henry getting things started here with Tommaso Ciampa. The referee gets underway. Here we go. Big matchup here between DIY and the boys. The boys, of course, we did talk about it. We touched on it. Lucha Bros are the Tag Team Champions after that matchup with the Thunderweights in Pete Dunn and Jushin Thunder Liger. And we talked about the boys beating the Lucha Bros on the very first... It was either the first show or the second show, definitely in the early episodes of BCW. But the boys have a win over the Lucha Bros. That might put them in good stead for a tag team title opportunity. Side of the from Tommaso Ciampa, meanwhile, go down the ring. A DIY has not been the best start. They have one loss already. But are looking to get on to the winning streak here that they feel like they should be on. Big forearm there from Tommaso Ciampa. You see a lot of team, team DIY in the last time we saw them uh, on, the, on the ring in BCW. Look at this from Tommaso. No, he slayed a big lariat for reversal. And he slayed it. Hangs out smartly to Mark Henry. You know, it's good to have a partner in Mark Henry. And Tommaso Ciampa not opting to tag out to Johnny Gargano. It's a bit of tension between DIY. You know their recent history, the history between these two in NXT, but uh, this is a new beginning here in BCW. Tommaso Ciampa, meanwhile, thinks he can handle Mark Henry on his own, but so far, doing that rolling Larry. Look at that. Beautifully done from Tommaso Ciampa. The psycho killer. Show what he can do here against the world's strongest man, and you ain't going to win that contest, son. Mark Henry, look at this. Big ol' headbutt. Bald head meets bald head. Mark Henry now. Oh, reversal from Tommaso Ciampa. Going for that Irish whip in the corner goes Mark Henry. Johnny Gargano waiting on the apron. But a big reversal from Mark Henry there. Kick to the leg. Mark Henry. I feel like, was he bringing him to the corner? Brings him to the corner. It's some tag team move. This is what we want to see. It's some tag team offense from a tag team. And the boys showing that. Look at this. Whoop. Nicely done. Mark Henry and Heath Slater. The boys show what they can do here tonight. Reversal to Tommaso Ciampa. Now, Irish within the corner goes Heath Slater. And Ciampa can tag out here. Which he does. Here's some teamwork from DIY. Irish whip. Drop toe hold. And a little elbow ski. Nicely done. And now we see Johnny Gargano for the first time in this matchup. Johnny Gargano working that arm straight away. Heath Slater. Oof. Big throw from Gargano. But a big forearm in return from Heath Slater. Look at this. Up on the shoulders. Big gut buster as well from Slater. We mentioned Heath Slater and the boys. Well, he is part of the boys. Heath Slater, Mark Henry, both looking to get in that tag team title picture. As is DIY. But more of a case is being made for the boys. They should have been possibly considered for the matchup with Money in the Bank. And they do have a win over the Lucha Brothers. So they would feel like they should be they should have been in that matchup with the Thunderweights. And of course the case could be made for Seth Wallins and Adam Cole Bebe, the drip Bebe. Who of course have a win over DIY, I believe. DIY is the only the only team with no wins currently in BCW. And he's there to go to work. But look at this. Johnny Gargano reversing. Johnny wrestling. Big Larry over the top rope. Goes Heath Slater. And Gargano following Heath Slater. And many a match has ended in count out so far here in BCW. Big cutter from Johnny Gargano. In fact, the paper we had a couple of count out wins for... Well, a count out draw between Matt Riddle and Eddie Kingston. Big reversal there for Johnny Gargano. Big rolling elbow from Gargano. Looks to tag out to Tommaso Ciampa, which he does. 
Heath Slater staying in the ring. No, he's not. Oh, yes, he is. Champa backstabber. Huge move. Heath Slater looking to tag out to his partner who's waiting. And Tommaso Champa stopping him from reaching his partner. Big drop kick to the chest of Heath Slater. But Slater, revert, well, getting out of the ring very quickly. Get out of dodge. He stayed Irish whip in the ropes and look at that flapjack! Nicely done from Slater. He Slater kicking him in his ass there, you saw that? Oh, the tag being made, he's bringing in the big guns. Mark Henry back in the ring with Tommaso Ciampa again. Johnny Gargano yet to face Mark Henry in this matchup so far. He's only had to deal with Slater. Oh boy, look at the strength! Look at the strength from Mark Henry! That's the world's strongest man right there! He picked him up with ease. Like he weighs nothing. 200 pounds of nothing. Mark Henry, look at this. Go for power. No, DT reversal from Tommaso Ciampa. And Mark Henry getting out of dodge. Same to his partner did earlier. Look at Ciampa trying to follow him, but Mark Henry's quickly to get back in the ring. Went for that punch. You saw that. Oh. Oh, Mark Henry this time has him. The quick movements from Henry has got him in this position. Big old jackknife powerbomb. Mark Henry. Tommaso Ciampa's back up though. Oh, wait a minute. This isn't good. Backdrop driver to Tommaso Ciampa. Gargano has to be tagged in. He is tagged in, as is Heath Slater. Gargano is in. Does Mark Henry feel Gargano? No, he does not. I think he just knows Heath Slater's got his number there with a big lariat there. Gargano in trouble. Or reversal there. Gargano needs to bring the fight for his team against Heath Slater, Rony Elbow from Gargano, Johnny Wrestling, the Slater's back up to his feet another light suplex from Gargano nice little bridge did not stick with the bridge, he instead opts to do more damage to Heath Slater oh the Gargano escape the Gargano escape is Slater's on the ropes, he saw the foot on the rope there from Slater, Mark Henry coming in just in case and if Gargano's a little further away from the ropes maybe a submission victory would have been in his, in his dis, not so distant future. Look at that grab in the left. Oh, big old cradle shock. Shout out to Chris Sabin. Gargano. He's bringing it here. And the guy's going for it again. Hooks the leg. Boom. It's similar to a cradle shock. Maybe like a Kiwi Crusher instead. But the cover made by Gargano, that could be it for Slater. One, two. Oh, I think Slater kicked out. I think Mark Henry did not get there in time. Slater, oh, Slater's amped up, baby. The one-man band. Look out here, big knee to Gargano. And Slater, big old punch. Slater now looking to finish the job here. Big suplex, nicely done by Slater. Gargano's in trouble. Tommaso Ciampa is watching on. Mark Henry as well is watching on. His partner do the business here, putting it. Gargano in a split. Look out here. Tag made? No, he's not going to tag out to his partner. I think words of encouragement from Mark Henry is being said there. Let him get this work. Put him in the hall of pain for me. It's a joint hall of pain when Mark Henry and he said together, the boys. Look out here on the shoulders. What's... Slater so got in store, gut bust there again to Gargano this time. Now he's Slater looking for something. Big punch. And look at this. Oh, nicely done. It's sort of like a zigzag. Shout out to Ziggler. Slater dragging away from the rope. Smart maneuver, but maybe too close to Champa. The count from the referee. The count from the referee, sorry. Only a one count. Gargano's back up to his feet. Johnny Wrestling back up. But Slater is well aware of this. Boom! There it is! I think that's his finisher. It's not the finish, though. Oh, Carl over type. It looks like Gargano gets the best of it. Pushed him away. Big gut kick from Heath Slater. On the shoulders again. Another gut buster inbound. There it is. Johnny Gargano is sweating profusely. You can see. Tag made to Champa. Slater was taunted to the crowd. And Champa, oh, Mr. Lariat. Neckbreaker. Oh, that's gonna hurt for Champa. 
He's Slater dragging him away from the ropes. And now Slater. Look at this. Going for that arm. He's got the arm lock in. And he's going to oh, do some damage to it. Gargano not in the corner for Champa at the moment. But look at Champa. He can do it himself. Look at this. Oh, nicely done. Nice little neck breaker. I'm going to call her a neck breaker. Champa torn into the crowd. But he Slater has a partner in Mark Henry. Oh, went for that big Larry, but look at Champa. German suplex. He picked him off his feet. Champa going for it again. Another German and Mark Henry. One more time. The strength on Champa. To even lift Mark Henry is incredible. Tommaso Champa is calling for it here. Maybe he's looking to punt his skull. Oh no, and knee his skull as well. Instead, sorry. Tommaso Champa. Feels like could be it. And to get DIY's first win here in BCW. One, two. Oh, Mark Henry kicking out a two. The boys are still alive here. But look at Champa. He's had enough. He's choking Mark Henry. He's had enough of him. Saying his beat isn't better than his. Champa big. Oh, slaps and punches. Big knee as well to Mark Henry. Oh, Mark Henry's not happy. Mark Henry is not a happy man. Look at this. Oh, my God. The submission maneuver. Look at Gargano stopping the submission. He had to just intervene to help his partner. And Mark Henry just calling Champa to get back up. Daring him to get back up. Look at this, Mark Henry. Irish whip to the outside. Goes Champa. And knowing this matchup, it could end on the outside. Big punch from Mark Henry. That's a, that's a big clubbing blow. The big hug on the outside. If Champa taps on the outside, it's not going to count. Look at this. Look at this from Mark Henry. He's tapping. He's tapping. Mark Henry felt the tap. But it's not going to count. It's not going to end the contest. But Champa. Oh. Puts him on the railing there. What's he got in store for Mark Henry? Oh, he's back into the railing there. The steer railing. The barriers to keep away the fans from being in some form of danger. Breaking the ice with Champa. The referee is still counting. He's at seven. Look at Mark Henry. Throwing Champa back into the ring. He wants to finish things here. He's made Champa tap out. He may try and finish the job here. That's what he does. He's Slater watching on. Fixing his wrists. Look out here. Oh, big gut punch. Gargano watching from the outside. Mark Henry is daring him to get back up again. Champa looks dazed and confused. Gargano watching on. Is he going to go for a bear hug? No, wait a minute. World's Strongest Slam. World's Strongest Slam. And that could be it for Champa. One. Two. Oh, Gargano gets in just in time. Slater wasn't there to stop it. Oh, Mark Henry, I think he's had his vaccine. Because he is feeling different. What is this? What is this? Is this a, another jackknife? Mark Henry. Oh, jackknife powerbomb. That's what he does. Gargano watching. Mark, what has happened to Mark Henry? He's incensed. He is pissed off here. He is not happy. Champa reversing whatever Mark Henry had in store. And Champa asking for more. Big punch to Mark Henry. And then take it back on the outside. This time Champa controlling things here. Referee starts his count. Look at Champa. Big knee on the outside. What a bond burner attack. He managed to officially open things up here on BCW. The biggest con in wrestling. What's well, not a big con is this matchup. This has been a great matchup. Mark Henry in the steel railing. Excuse me. The fans are getting a close-up view of Tommaso Ciampa beating down Mark Henry. And look at this. Ciampa just beating the hell out of him. He's had enough. The referee is still counting. Ciampa stomps on the arm. There's a seven count here. Mark Henry back to his feet. 
Oh, the, the tango, and they're having a dance. A dance off here. Oh, they go around each other, around in circles. Oh, Mark Abel for that forearm. Champa rushing back to the ring. They're at a nine count. I think Champa would break the count, but Mark Henry got back just in time. Oh, he's asking him to come back in the ring. Big shot from Champa. But look at Mark Henry. Big old backbreaker to Champa. It's been a war between Champa and, so and Mark Henry. Gargano and Slater have not seen the ring since these two have tagged back in. Look at Champa, big old jawbreaker to the world's strongest man. Champa calling for that big knee again. This potentially could end the match here. The big knee, and that's with the steel brace on his knee. The cover being made by Champa, the one, the two, three, and DIY pick up their first win as a tag team here in BC Derby. Wait, what? Mark Henry. I think Mark Henry upset with what happened tonight. He's later coming in to check out on his buddy. What's going on here? Just seeing the boys already? See it? Descent among the ranks between the boys? Oh no. We may have only made a company for about a month now. But already. There is tension between Mark Henry and Heath Slater, the boys. They couldn't get the job done here tonight. DIY, though, pick up a huge win in his tag team contest. Let's roll on here on BCW. BCW rolls on here in Cologne, Germany. And are the Warriors out tonight? Because the Ultimate Warrior has arrived. The Ultimate Warrior was a part of that Money in the Bank matchup and ultimately came up short in the end, but this power of the Warriors still remains. And there's something definitely powering that Warrior tonight here in Cologne, Germany. He is amped up. Big matchup here for the Ultimate Warrior. Can he get the job done here tonight and make it in singles action at least 1 1? 3-0. We're about to find out in just a moment here for the Ultimate Warrior. Oh, and we're about to bring the swag here in Germany. Andrew Dog is still repping up the Street Profits gear, but we know he's no longer has Montez Ford by his side, at least in BCW. But he's still repping the colors here tonight. But Andrew Dog is looking to get back on winning terms here, of course, after being jumped out by the game Triple H on last week's edition of BCW. Looking to get a win back here, and he chose the Ultimate Warrior to try and get his win back. Oh boy, Angelo. What are you thinking? An look at this. Look at, look at the Warrior. Look at how rip this guy is whether it's all natural or not he do not mess with Lemoria but Angelo Dawkins feels like he has this in the bag will Angelo Dawkins be able to bring the swag here and get the victory or will the warrior get it done we're about to find out here in just a short minute with Andrew Dawkins go one on one with the ultimate warrior it is time for the warrior and Dawkins to meet. Our referee getting us underway here. And before we move any any uh, further on with this contest, we'll talk about that the end bit we saw with uh, Mark Henry and Heath Slater. Descent among the boys. That, I don't know if they have what it takes to be a tag team, apparently. We're only in our fourth week. It's the third time we've seen them compete. And already there's a descent among the ranks between Heath Slater and Mark Henry. After that loss of DIY, it's DIY. Meanwhile, have their first victory in the company, which puts them in a good position for those tag team title shots in the future. You know, Dawkins, nicely done there. Look at that. See from Andrew Dawkins, he's doing good. Trying to kick him away. Reversal there from a warrior. <coughs> uh oh. 
This is not good. Gorilla press slam on Dawkins. There it is. And the warrior splash to the back. And he thinks that's it. He's got the knees on him. No way. Oh, Dawkins kicking out the last moment there. It looked like Warrior had it in the bag. But he kicked out of it. Look at this. Oh, look at that from Dawkins reversing. Can we stop with the Warrior though? Look at that. Irish whip in the corner goes Dawkins. Reversal from Dawkins. Look at this. Big German. Oh, big takedown. At that waist lock. He's still got it again. Look at that. Showing his mat wrestling skill here against the Warrior. The Warrior may have abs of steel, but Andrew Dawkins has the technique and skill. Look at this big power moves. Power versus skill here. As Dawkins now looks to get back up. Big stomp from the Warrior. Another stomp from the Ultimate Warrior. Reverse lift from Dawkins. Oh, wait a minute. Look at that scoop slam. Oh, God, just threw him. Jesus Christ. Does not care about this man. Does the Warrior. Throws him across the ring as well. Angelo Dawkins is in trouble here at the moment. Look out, big old backbreaker to Angelo Dawkins. Meanwhile, Dawkins now in trouble. Thrown around like a ragdoll by Ultimate Warrior. This has not been Dawkins' night so far, but that could change it. DDT there to the Warrior. And now, oh, big knee from the Ultimate Warrior. Big old punch as well. This is not good for Dawkins. As the Ultimate Warrior, big punch, sends him down. And the Warrior wisely rolls to the outside. and Oh, he's flexing on him, even hooking that rope. Look at this reversal there from the Warrior. Look at a big spear. That was a spear from Warrior. Jesus. Dawkins is back up, though. Throws him across. Into the oh near the steel railing. And look at that, he's bringing the swag here in Germany. Big punch from Dawkins. Big kick from the Warrior. Oh god. Both men on the outside here. We're at a five count from the referee. Suplex from the Warrior. That's a big snap suplex. Ultimate Warrior. May think about bringing Dawkins back into the ring. Oh, instead throws him into that. LED turnbuckle. That LED ring post. Rather. The gal here throwing him across. And Warrior, I think, will take a count of victory here. He's put him far away from the ring. He says, Referee, keep counting. Oh no, he broke the count. I thought he's going to take a count of victory there, Warrior, but you know he wants to do the noble way. Look at reversing there from Dawkins. Maybe the wrong move there from Ultimate Warrior. Maybe he should have taken the count of victory. Throws him across once again. Ran a four count early on here. Big old backbreaker there for Warrior. And now a six count big punch from the Warrior. Oh, Dawkins the one thrown back in the ring. Andrew Dawkins back in the ring with the Warrior. Look at this. What's he going for here? Inverted DDT. Inverted DDT. Beautifully done. Angelo Dawkins is feeling himself now. Irish whip over the top rope. Goes the Warrior. And Warrior now in trouble here. Dawkins now has the matchup in control. Referee starts to count again. We've seen this match on the outside. Spear from Dawkins. Another spear of his own. Big kick from Dawkins. He's always oh, amped up. Look at him. He's had enough of the Warrior's antics here. Big elbow drop to the lower back there. Did the kidney area. Of the warrior and oh warrior though reversing that I don't know what Dawkins was standing still for it allowed Warrior to snap out of that dazed confused state he was in big punch there for warrior now oh, warrior what's he got in store he's standing still now and that's allowed Dawkins to come back into it big spear from Dawkins the count is still going missed the kick we're on an eight count Look at Warrior throw him in the steps. Oh god, we're at nine. Warrior better get back in the ring. No, he's stomping away. We're at nine. We're ten. A draw for the Warrior and for Dawkins. No one wins. No one bloody wins, of course.
He says he believes in Dawkins. Well, I guess you half you were half there. Halfway there. You believed you got a draw. And you damn right he did. So this contest ends in a draw. Both men do not win, but both men do not lose. So cool stuff here on Base AW. Well, coming up next here on BCW is a women's matchup here. The first women's match of the evening. As we see Alexa Bliss challenging Sasha Banks here. Sasha Banks come from a huge defeat at the pay-per-view to Shayna Baszler to be crowned the inaugural BCW Women's World Champion. Banks was unable to do so. Alexa Bliss, I believe, also coming off a big loss for the pay-per-view against Jungle Kiona. So both women come off a lot of big losses at the pay-per-view. And now they're looking to get a win to redeem themselves from that paper. Let's see what happens here between Banks and Bliss as next on BCW. The crowd is ready, as am I. And in the words of Michael Cole, it's boss time. Here she is. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks. The boss is in town and she is not in a happy mood. Sasha Banks was hoping to be coming here to BCW as the inaugural women's champion. Instead, that honor went to Shayna Baszler, the queen of spades, who is now top of the division. Because Banks are going to make her way back up there and try and get back at Shayna Baszler, who now has defeated the boss. And Sasha Banks, although lost to Shayna Baszler, still has a good, impressive win-loss record so far in BCW. Looking to improve on that as well against Alexa Bliss. Can she do it? We're about to find out in just a moment. And here comes Alexa Bliss. Alexa Bliss, the Ohio native, coming down the aisle here. Coming through lost herself against the debuting Jungle Kiona. She's not happy with that at all. Putting over new people in the company. Of course, she was put over by Kyrie Sane and her debut match, so. But maybe it was a difference. This is on TV, she won. She lost her paper. Maybe that's why she pissed off or blissed off, sorry about. But Alexa Bliss also looking to get back on winning terms here. And finds herself against Sasha Banks. Huge match coming up here on BCW between Alexa Bliss and Sasha Banks. So like we said, a huge matchup coming up here between Bliss and Banks. Should be very interesting to see what happens. Connor with tie between Banks and Bliss. Bliss winning that exchange there early on. And look at this. Banks throwing Bliss off. Into the ropes. Oh, Sasha Banks did not take a shoulder tackle. Instead, just went for that leaping lariat. Nice one from Banks. Snapmare into a kick. Very, very cool indeed. Sasha Banks feeling herself right now with a bulldog. Nicely done. And we got to talk about Banks' match against Shayna Baszler at the pay view. Shayna Baszler getting the huge victory over Sasha Banks. Of course, becoming our women's champion. And Shayna Baszler is watching this matchup with a close eye. As she sees her rival, Sasha Banks, an early rival here in BCW, compete against Alexa Bliss. Big drop kick from Bliss. Meanwhile, Alexa Bliss, I'm, my voice is cracking all over the place, guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> but Alexa Bliss, coming for the big loss herself against Jungle Kiona. Huge debut for Kiona. We felt the jungle power and Bliss is blissed off. And Bliss looking to get back on winning terms here. Big suplex there from Bliss in a recover. Referee going for that pin, but the only, not, not even one count, just a no count there from uh, the referee. So Bang's clean, not damaged enough. Abdominal stretch. This will do it. That's a finish. No big punches there from Sasha Banks. And look at this. Whoop. Nice down from Banks. Reversing that abdominal stretch. Big drop kick as well from Banks to follow. Bliss now getting back up. But Banks is still on the attack. Big shot from Bliss. And look out here. Neck breaker. Nicely done. We know one of her signature moves. Sasha Banks is at double arms crossed. Neck breaker, followed by the bank statement. Big back body drop though from Banks. That was huge. 
with that kick reversed by Bliss. Look out over the chop block it looked like. Oh big running knee. Alex Bliss on the ground in, in MMA that would be illegal or at least in UFC it would be. That knee while she's still grounded is not is a big no-no. But the pro wrestling world is a big yes yes. But look at Banks looking for a neck breaker while she's uh, awkwardly on the ropes and Alexa Bliss taken down by Sasha Banks. Is it boss time here in BCW? We'll see if Banks will challenge Baszler once again for the title if she can rack up another an impressive couple wins here. Of course the reason we put Banks and Baszler together is because they had that one draw against one another and they both built on their records with wins. Baszler currently undefeated in this company now with two wins, one draw. Zero losses. Banks has that one loss to Baszler. But looks to get back on the winning streak here. And Bliss is just taunting the crowd here. Pointing at those three dudes sitting in those seats. That people already have bought. They're suited for a wrestling show. I don't know why. Looks at Bliss. Big neck break of her own. Look at that. Like a neck break. So stunner style there. We're at seven count here. Is it another count out victory? Well, another count out draw going to happen here? Banks is back up. Bliss is not interested in taking things to the ring. But she's going to go back in the ring herself. I think she can ask the count out. Sasha Banks? Yeah. No. No, she's interested in keeping this match going. Big bulldog there from Bliss. As we say, the last match ended in a count out there between... Oh, it's another nasty little neck breaker there. Big double knees. And again. Double knees again from Alexa Bliss on the outside. Doesn't want to throw her back in the ring, though. Puts her in that uh, steel railing. The steel. Look out here. Nicely done from Bliss. Those barriers keeping the fans away from the danger of the wrestling world here. We're at an eight count. Banks looking to get back in the ring. She might take a count of victory, you know. She's the boss. Oh, she is. Oh, I thought she was taking the count out victory there. Banks back out. We're back at a one count again. And Bliss finally brings things back to the ring. And here comes Alexa Bliss. Now looking for a back body drop. Lands it perfectly as well. A lot of punishment was taken on the outside by both these women here. Bliss going up. No, she's not. She was just uh, going in the corner there. She's looking for what she's going to do next. DDT. That's what she's looking for. And that could be it for Banks. Alexa Bliss. One. Two. Oh, wow. It was close. Alexa Bliss thought she had the three count. She's even asking the referee. That was three. Not asking, telling the referee that was three. Referee telling her. Two count. Get your mind. Focus on smash up, Bliss. Big clothesline from Sasha Banks and Alexa Bliss is in trouble here in the corner. Oh wait. Sasha Banks dragging Bliss towards the center. Smart from... Oh! Reversal! Look at that! Oh look out! Banks! Meteora! And oh I think she's good for the pin. Big Meteora from Sasha Banks. That's what she needed. Look out here! Big scoop and a slam! Nicely done. Now Banks in control of this matchup here. It looked like Bliss had the, her way with this matchup, but it's gone back to Banks. Oh, I think she went for that backstab, but reversed by Bliss. Big form to the back. Big bulldog from Alexa Bliss. And now Bliss has the match back in her favor. She may go for the pin here. Oh, Banks is back to her feet straight away. Lariat. Another Lariat. And big drop kick from Sasha Banks. Sasha Banks feeling it now. Alexa Bliss in trouble. Now Sasha Banks. Go for that guillotine choke. This could be it for Alexa Bliss. She's looking to do it by way of submission. But look at Alexa Bliss. Nicely done. Gets out of it. Very, very flexible. <laughs> Flexibly. Neck breaker from Banks. Got here. Big kick to the gut. And look at that. That's the move we were talking about earlier. The double arm cross neck breaker. Banks thinks that's it. Bliss, this could be over for Alexa Bliss. The one, two. Oh, kick out two both times. We've seen now two kickouts from both these women. Alexa Bliss kicked out of that, and Banks kicked out of that DDT earlier. Look at Sasha Banks. We're thinking Banks' statement. Oh, reversed. 
Bliss. DDT. DDT. The second one might be the one. The cover. The one. The two. Oh, that's a media kick out too. Not like the last DDT. It took a while for Banks to get her bearings to kick out the first one. The second one. Not a problem. Oh, maybe one more. No. Code Red. Oh, nice. Alexa Bliss in control of this matchup here. Sasha Banks needs to bring something here. Because Alexa Bliss is... Oh, wait. There it is. Big punch. She brought it. She brought the punch. Oh, is this the bank statement? There it is. Backcracker. Or oh, backstabber into the bank statement. Oh, I think her feet just touched the ropes. And Sasha Banks maybe thinking Frog Splash in tribute to Eddie Guerrero. Be without us, ah, Frog Splash. She can go for the pin? No, she's not. Maybe thinking. Well, I don't know what she's thinking. Bliss is back up. DDT. One more time. Third time's the charm for Bliss. Is this it now, Alexa Bliss? One. Two. Three. And Alexa Bliss picks up a huge win over Sasha Banks. The double knees from back. We saw a lot of this match on the outside there. Bliss with the double knees. Her hair's are going all over the place. There, I saw a lot of pink. Sasha Banks, we thought this would be it here. The double arm neck cross neck breaker. She landed it very well, and Banks was convinced that was it for Bliss. But as you see here, Bliss kicking out the last possible second. There's a DDT. This might be the third one that Bliss landed on Sasha Banks. No, it isn't. It's the second one. It doesn't matter. She ended by a DDT. She picked up a big win after that hit few loss to Jungle Kiona. But that's the best research in herself into that women's division. Meanwhile, for Banks, this is a huge loss here for Sasha Banks. What is next for the boss? We don't know. But for Alexa Bliss, at least, it is a huge win for her. And, well, we'll see what happens next in the upcoming weeks for Alexa Bliss. Big win for her and Sasha Banks. We don't know what's next for her. Let's roll on to BCW. Well, coming up next, we have not heard a word, a peep, from this man in quite some time. We have not heard from Homer J. Simpson since his win at Money in the Bank. And he's coming out here to talk something. Talk about stuff. He's going to talk about stuff. We'll see what Homer has to say in this bit next here on BCW. Well, there he is, Homer J. Simpson, feeling the power of the people tonight. I don't know if the people appreciate him, but we'll see. Homer J. Simpson has a few words to say here after that win and money in the bank. You can boo, yell and scream at your insults all you want. That would choose the fact that I'm here in the middle of this ring, living the dream that each and every one of you in the crowd are too weak, too lazy, too stupid to achieve. Go ahead, hold up your signs, chant your chance, because deep down, you damn well that I'm everything you've ever wanted to be. Damn, Stone Cold possibly speaking the truth there. Interesting, interesting. Stone Cold Homer Simpson. Look around this arena reminds me of, of, ju of the just how happy. Reminds me of the just how happy I have to not be from this town. I mean, have you looked yourself in the mirrors? My dog walking backwards looks better than all of you. I guess that's why you all came to see me tonight. For once, you get to see what real greatness looks like. Damn, he's saying he's great. Damn, son. Seems like he sounds a little helper. Can walk better than the people of Cologne, Germany. The the BCW deserves so much more than all these rat tag cookie cutter superstars in the locker room today. Nobody can do what I can do. I'm the best freaking superstar on the planet. It's time everyone recognizes that. Damn, is he saying he's the best in the planet? Not just the world, the planet? Is that a hint that Daniel Bryan, the planet's champion? Homer J. Simpson calling out the champion, potentially? Good. You don't want me here, and I don't want to be here. Looks like you've got some brains after all. Or at least some brain cells. I'm not sure we can scientifically call what's in your skulls a brain. Oh, damn, he's, just, he's just firing shots at these lovely fans here in Cologne, Germany. What's wrong with Germany, Homer? Uh, what's wrong with Cologne, Germany? He's thinking, what's right with Cologne, Germany, son? Stone, stone, keep going stone cold, Homer Simpson. I guess he has that. If you haven't made my attention clear enough at this point, you haven't been listening. Nobody's got me from getting what I want in this company. I will spend my legacy by destroying everyone else. 
Let the slaughter begin. Oh my god. Homer Simpson is calling the shots. I think that path of contrary started. He's already slaughtered Stone Cold twice. He slaughtered Kurt Angle as well. Looked like about to end his career, but big words from Homer Simpson here. Mic drop moment. Yeah, there it is. The mic drop. Homer Simpson. Maybe calling out everybody, anybody in BCW to try and step to him. Because Homer Simpson ain't playing around. He ain't playing no games. Big words from our undefeated Homer Simpson. Moving swiftly on here with BCW here tonight. It's a Kato Shida! It's Shida time, baby. Hikaru Shida making her singles debut here in BC because we saw her at that Money in the Bank pay-per-view. She made her presence felt. But tonight she is here for one-on-one -on -one action here. Very exciting times. Hikaru Shida in BCW. Will she get a win here? We're about to find out. We don't know who her opponent will be. Let's see. Oh my god. That cannot be one person. It's Ronda Rousey! She's here! And from Venice, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey! Former UFC champion, former WWE champion, now here in BCW, making her official debut here. Big time matchup coming up here. For Ronda Rousey, let's see what she can do here against Hikaru Shida. The fans loving it tonight, loving Ronda Rousey. Here's Hikaru Shida, there's Ronda Rousey. Referee gets us underway, here we go. Big time matchup here with Hot Ronda Rousey. That's what I said in the sign there, Hot Ronda, not Hot Rod. Well, speaking of Hot Rod, we do have him on the books here at BCW. We just want to uh, point that out. But I have no idea when he wants to uh, start here in BCW. Big knee for Hikaru Shida and a leg drop to follow. So I'd let you guys know that. But uh, we do have Ronda Rousey. A good friend of Hot Rod. Look at this. Nicely done. Double up hook suplex. You saw that? From Hikaru Shida. Big time move. And control the tempo of the matchup early on here against Ronda Rousey. Look at Ronda. Back to her feet. Of course, Ronda Rousey must have been watching and paying attention to the BCW Money in the Bank pay-per-view. Good little Frankenstein there from Ronda Rousey. Oh, and there's doing what she does best, the judo throws. Of course, the gold medalist. Also, no, not gold medalist, bronze medalist in judo. It's a big old punch as well to Hikaru Shida. Now here comes Ronda Rousey. Look at this again, landing that little Frankensteiner, Hurricane Rana. Ronda Rousey slamming people and now she's in control. I was about to say, Ronda Rousey must be paying attention to BCW a little bit at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view. Of course, we saw Shayna Baszler, a fellow four horsewoman, a fellow horsewoman, part of the four horsewomen of MMA, winning and capturing that uh, BCW Women's World Championship. So Ronda Rousey must... Oh, God! Have her eye on that, but also... She had her eye on Hikaru Shida's head. And a big old punch to follow. And now Ronda thinks that could be it here for Hikaru Shida. One count only. Don't count out Hikaru Shida yet. Holy Shida. Here on BCW. But, oh, reverse from Hikaru Shida. Snap mare. Big kick to the back. And Shida now. Looking to uh, get some... Oh, look at this. Big old Michinoku driver. Big Michinoku driver from Hikaru Shida. We know she's that running knee. She does the Falcon Arrow as well as her finishing maneuvers. We speak about the title. Well, Hikaru Shida had a chance to capture a briefcase to guarantee us of a title match. If she can guarantee us of a victory here, she can land this. Oh, big! The Stormbreaker. She has to win off today. Hikaru Shida thinks that's it for Ronda in her debut. Oh, 
two count only. And Ronda's back up already from that maneuver. She just got to watch out for Ronda. Oh, the punches. The punches. She's shooting. Now Ronda Rousey. Oh, went for that head kick again. Missing. And he kind of Sheeta now. Look at this. Sheeta is putting Ronda against the ropes. Yes, she is. What's she going for here? Look out. Big forearm. Out to the ring. Look at this. Hikaru Shida is going for it. Oh, look at that. Suicide dive. Going out from the bottom rope. The crowd loving this matchup. Shida, Falcon Arrow. Oh, no, the squats. The squatting suplex on Ronda Rousey. The people loving this matchup. Suplex, lovely from Shikaru Shida. We're at a four count here. Don't want to send the count out, surely. Oh, in the ring post goes Hikaru Shida. Ronda Rousey. Maybe thinking, no, she's thinking about keeping it outside. Oh, and the steps goes Hikaru Shida. This is not good news for the fans if this ends in a count out draw. Rousey, look at this. Oh God, gut wrench slam. I don't know what you call that. Look at Rousey, kick to the leg. Ronda's got to think about, oh no, it's getting a draw. No, Ronda Rousey, going for the win. Ronda Rousey wins by count out. Controversial debut victory for Ronda Rousey. I what a match we had before that count out victory for Rousey. The crowd a little bit disappointed in that finish, and I, I am as well. We saw a good back and forth exchange between Sheeta and Rousey. But in the end, it was Ronda Rousey who beat the count. And Sheeta must be disappointed in herself. She could not get back into the ring. Before the count of 10, referee. There's a pinfall attempt there from Sheeta, but there it is. Look at this. On the outside, as you can see, the count was being applied there by the referee. This is the end of the match. There's that 10. I was trying to get the crowd on his side. I don't think it's going to cut it, Ronda. Controversial ending to the matchup against Yukaru Shida. Winning by count out. I don't think that's a good thing at all. And yeah, you damn right it's going to be a rivalry match between these two. Rousey picking up a huge win here on her debut. Very controversial count out victory. I'm sure it's not the end of this feud between Shida and Rousey. Well, coming up next, we have a huge singles match lined up here. Two singles matches come up after that Ronda Rousey Shida match. This is the first one. As we see Daniel Bryan taking on Alistair Black and this should be an interesting counter because one man has a title the other has a briefcase we'll see what happens between these two here tonight on BCW the crowd is ready in anticipation and are ready to greet the new BCW heavyweight champion of the world and here he is there's the belt around his waist Daniel Bryan is here The World Heavyweight Champion, Daniel Bryan, has arrived for the first time since Money in the Bank. We see him with that title around his waist. Of course, being Saitama, One Punch Man, in a brutal two out of three falls contest, has arrived here on the scene with that title firmly around his waist. And you must have heard earlier tonight about Homer Simpson calling him out, potentially. For a future title match. But Daniel Bryan now has that championship. He has a huge target on his back. And everybody is looking to shoot down the world champion. And that includes this man, Alistair Black. Alistair Black has a briefcase. He's ditched the entrance tonight. No candles. 
door still creaking though. Look at that. Listen to it. Balister Black has a guaranteed world title opportunity in his hand right there. That money in the bank briefcase. So Danny Bryan's got to watch out for that man in the future. Maybe even tonight. We never know. Balister Black knows he has that briefcase and an opportunity in hand. But can Alistair Black get past the world champion tonight? Let's find out. People chatting Daniel Bryan, Alistair Black, here he is, and we get set for action here. It's champion versus potential challenger in the future. Alistair Black. And looking at the rankings earlier as well, Alistair Black was ranked number one in the rankings. So he, he could be the new number one contender. He is, he is the number one contender. He's the money, Mr. Money in the Bank. We're already doing a good job of Daniel Bryan here. Good job from Alistair Black. And go for the cover immediately. It's a one count on the champ. Now the Black felt that was enough to take out the champion. Brian trying to get a punch in, trying to grab him, but now the Black not complying with that. Irish whip. Oh, big double foot stomp to the champion. Huge for Black, and look at this big kick to the back, the lower back of Brian. Daniel Brian, oh, back up, but reverse. Now the Black is calling for his head. Big punch to the outside. Uh oh. We're back on the outside again. Now, for the last match, I had a controversy. What about this match? Oh, God. Near the steel steps. Not even hitting those steps. Hitting the apron. Look out here. Oh, that's the black, though. Look at that. Oh, he's sitting on the floor. He's asking for more. That's the black. Hasn't got the best win record here. Win loss record here currently. Of course, losing to Matt Cardona. And then losing a tag team matchup. Nice from Daniel Bryan. But he did win the Money in the Bank briefcase. So that puts him in a very good position as a wrestler here on the roster. He only has that guaranteed title opportunity. Oh, God. No, not again. Daniel, stop working the arm. Get back in the ring. The boast is that. They don't care about the count. We have a draw. Two count outs. What is going on? Guys. Oh, come on. Oh, well, I guess they want to get straight to the main event, which I guess we're going to have to go to coming up right now. God damn. Okay, F fair enough. Coming up in our main event tonight, Stone Cold Steve Austin returns to action after that devastating loss to Homer Simpson as he takes on the Murder Hawk monster. Lance Archer. Can Austin get back away in terms or will Lance Archer add to Stone Cold's misery? We'll find out right here, right now in our main event of BCW. And here we go. Oh, wait a minute. It's time for Stone Cold Steve Austin. The Texas Jurassic returns to action here tonight and it's not been a great week. Excuse me. For Stone Cold Steve Austin. Of course losing that match to Homer J. Simpson. He is not he has not picked up a win here in BCW as of yet, but he is still coming out here to try and whip some ass. And Stone Cold looks to do it here tonight in front of the BCW fans. The arena is ready for Stone Cold to do his business. So see if Stone Cold can get a win here tonight on our main event here for BCW. Oh, yeah. And here comes his opponents. There he is, 
Lance Archer is back on BCW TV. And his opponent from Texas, weighing in at 340 pounds, Lance Archer. Lance Archer back in action. Huge, huge matchup coming up here. Huge match here for Lance Archer, who is looking to get a win over Stone Cold Steve Austin. Of course, he, he himself looking for a win. He's not been featured a lot since our debut edition. Hang on a second. <coughs> so obviously Lance Archer looking to get a win here himself, but can he do it at the expense of a man who is desperate for a win? That is Stone Cold. Lance Archer. The Vidhoff Monster ready for action tonight here on BCW. The crowd firming in the corner of Austin. Lance Archer not getting no love from this crowd tonight. The referee rings the bell. Our main event begins here tonight. And a, oh, that big gut wrench already from Lance Archer. That was huge from Lance Archer. And actually, hold on a second. I'm getting word from backstage. Scott Steiner, after this match, is going to come down to the ring. So Scott Steiner wants to come down to this ring, and I guess he wants to talk a little bit. So I guess we're not done. Stay tuned for that, I guess, after this matchup between Archer and Austin. Let's just get into this matchup. But just thought I'd let you guys know. I'm getting word from backstage. Austin now, meanwhile. Look at this. Dealing with Lance Archer. Whoop. Down he goes. Big start here from Austin. Big punch. Oh my. Knocks down. Lance Archer reversed it. Lance Archer. Big shoulder tackle. Just jump out of my way, Shed. Uh oh. This is good for Austin. This is not good for Austin. Oh my god. A neck slam, we're going to call that. Gripping that neck. And a big lariat from old Lance Archer. Stone Cold in trouble. Crowd in the corner of Austin. I think him support he needs to get back in this matchup. Big punch from Lance Archer. And now, look at Lance. Picks a leg. Oh, going for that injured leg. Smart tactic. Go for the one with the brace on. That is the injured leg. Oh my, Jesus Christ. Lance Archer, this is actually his first singles match here in BCW. We've both seen him in tag team action. And or at the moment, he is currently donning the singles act contest with Stone Cold. Oh no, this isn't good. Oh, the big punches. Referee, got to stop it. He can't defend himself. Stone Cold Steve Austin is in trouble. Gets the arm, Lance Archer. What's he thinking here? He's got, oh, he's going old school? He's going old school, baby. Austin knows the thing or two about that move, I think. He must say it at least once. Look at Austin though. Big knee lift. Takes down Lance Archer. And now Austin. Looking to get back some offense here. Looking to get back in this matchup. Is that going for the arm? Good smart move from Austin. Work those limbs, son. But for that kick missing. Push from Austin. No. Lance Archer. No. That. Oh, look at that. Go straight for the pin. He's pushed him down. Only a one count. Lance Archer, whoa, look at his arm, do you see that? Twisting and what have you. Oh, oh, God, big slap. Big kick reversal from Austin. The kicks are coming in. Irish whip from Austin. Off the corner, big knee. Oh, hurt his own knee. Oh, big rolling chop. Oh, Rainmaker. Tuchko Carter style. No near the ropes, but a one count. Austin kicking out. He's on the apron. Smart move. Rolling to the outside of the ring. Look at Lance Archer. Big forearm. Uh -oh. oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Look at the strength from Lance Archer. Oh, my days. Stone Cold Steve Austin's in trouble. As we said, Lance Archer is in control of this matchup. Big chokes. I'm incoming. See you later, Stone Cold. 
And that could be it. Referee is there to count the pin. Ooh, two count only. Austin barely surviving though. He is barely surviving. Lance Archer is hell bent on making sure Stone Cold does not walk again. Big clothesline in the corner. Oh, wait a minute, son. He's stomping the mud hole right now. Stone Cold Steve Austin stomping that mud hole. Is that Stone Cold Stunner? I missed the Stone Cold Stunner. God damn it. Lariat from Austin. Another Lariat from Austin. Oh, wait a minute off the ropes. Big Lariat from Stone Cold Steve Austin. The comeback is real. Oh, went oh, for that knee lift, I think. Big punch to the back from Lance Archer. Oh, no. Oh, God. He's gone for the face. He's gone for the face. Sufficient maneuver from Lance Archer. Oh, wait a minute. Austin back up to his feet. Look at Austin. Big knee to the head of Lance Archer. Oh, oh I thought he was going for a DDT. That's a more effective move, apparently. Oh, I thought it was. DDT, look at that. Aye, 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 aye. Let's get the brave wave, son. Austin feeling the, the crowd here tonight. Feeding off the channeling their energy into this comeback on Lance Archer. And now Austin. Look at this. Stone Cold Stunner. Stone Cold Stunner. No, Austin's not finished. He doesn't want to finish it like that. He wants to do more damage to Lance Archer. Has he got another one lined up? Oh no. Oh, the Midor Dream. The Midor Dream. Oh, rope saving Lance Archer. Maybe he's a bit further away. Austin might have got a submission victory there. He's so close. Austin trying to get back on winning terms. He's trying to get a win. Oh, I think he went for it. Lance Archer said, no, no, son. Oh, God, no. Oh, God, no. Oh, God. Oh, he's got... I don't know what's happened. What the hell's happened to Lance Archer? He's now the Silver Surfer. What's going on? I did not know Lance Archer was... Could do that. He is silver. What has happened to Lance Archer? Is he okay? Stone Cold doesn't know what's happened to him either. Snap me. Oh, there he is. He's back to normal. We're fine. Lance Archer just turned silver a moment. And now Austin. is back to control this matchup. Maybe thinking. Oh, big knee again. Oh, wait a minute. DDT again, Landon. Austin picking him back up. Is there a stunner in line? No, another DDT. He's trying to keep the Murderhawk monster down. Maybe a third DDT. No. Big knees. To the gut and to the head. Archer still up. Third DDT from Austin. He's knackered. He's gassed. Look out, son. Stone Cold Stunner. Lou Fez Press. Oh, yeah. He says it's the finish, son. One, two, three. Stone Cold Steve Austin locks out the winner text. And he is the victorious one here tonight against Lance Archer. What a back and forth contest. Lance Archer looked like he had Stone Cold on the ropes, but Stone Cold persevered. Came back with his fighting spirit. The crowd feeding him the energy needed to get back in this matchup. And it was DDTs that played a part in Austin getting the victory here tonight. Even a couple of stunners, son. That Louis Thez Presda was the deciding factor. A couple more hits to the head to Larcher. So a couple hits to the head again and Austin is your victor. Officially his first victory in the BCW arena. He's got some Steve Weisers later on, I don't know. Oh, hell yeah. But Austin, huge win for Stone Cold. As I said, it's his first win here in BCW. It can only get things, can only get better for the Texas Brown Snake after that feud with home with Jay Simpson. Maybe my girlfriend again, who knows, but... Austin, for now at least, has a win in BCW. Congratulations to Stone Cold Steve Austin on this victory. And uh, 
Yes, right now, let's head on to the to see what's going on with Scott Steiner. Well, here comes Big Papa Pump, Scott Steiner. We, we, we're hoping we'd see him backstage or something, but no, he's coming down to the ring. After that huge main event with Austin to pick up the victory, Scott Steiner has a few things to say. <coughs> the funky music of Scott Steiner bringing through. There we go. Big Papa Pump, the big booty daddy himself, is here. Now then, what's he got to say to the crowd here tonight? It's got to be the wild roller coaster here in the BCW. Someone, someone says something, I say something back. Words get twisted, bones get broken. Craziness! Let's put all that aside and get down to the real issue. I hope you've cancelled all other plans tonight, because we're going to be here for a while. Look, Scott, we have no more time left, mate. We just had our main event. I don't know how much more time you think we have here, but YouTube can be pretty strict sometimes. When I compete, I turn all the dials up to 11 and I charge. There's no cruise control or break. I ride straight into danger and I enjoy doing it. I expect the same from every superstar. There's one in particular that stands out to me. To Scott Steiner. Who? Who's that? We guys had issues with a particular superstar. We'll see if he's talking about that same superstar we're thinking about. Scott Steiner. The fact is, Big Boss Man is a plague on the BCW. He's a disease that is slowly killing the, this company and this business. He's suffocating with his very presence. Larry disease has his cure. So Big Boss Man, get out of here and take your medicine. Oh shoot. Scott Steiner calling out the Boss Man. We know they had their issues. Of course, Scott Steiner and Boss Man had a little exchange in the ring before. Scott Steiner winning that exchange and... Well, here comes some hard times made for Scott Steiner. The big boss man is on his way down to the ring tonight. He's serving hard times to Scott Steiner. There he is. Oh, wait a minute. Both these men are involved in that Money in the Bank match. We saw them tangle a few times in that match. But tonight, now, we see them go face to face. I don't know what Scott Steiner and Bossman will have to say to each other here tonight. We'll see what he got to say here. Bossman staring him down. That's a Scott Steiner staring Bossman down. And now he's getting that microphone, son. What has Bossman got to say to the big booty daddy? What's Bossman got to say? Dude, I tried telling you this last week. I cannot believe you aren't listening. Now I have to come out, school you, and shame you in front of the entire BCW universe. So be it. There's some hard truth bombs I gotta drop on you. If that's what it takes, put your mic down and be prepared to listen. Oh, big boss man. I don't know if you remember last week, but Scott Steiner was uh, beating him senseless last week. That's what I saw. It's pretty obvious to me what's going on in your head right now. You're scared. You're so freaking scared. You feel me coming like an assassin in the night. You know I'm there. You know I'm dangerous, but you have no idea when I, when I will strike and how hard. Hard enough to take your championship. What? What championship? Scott, Scott, he's not a champion. What championship you want about you, mate? Scott Steiner, I don't know if he's delusional or what not. He thinks Bossman's a champion? What's he a champion of? You beauty you learned that when I come out, you bow my feet like the subjects you are. The same goes for you. You show me the proper respect that a man of my superior status deserves. I don't know what's going on. Something's going on here. Scott Steiner clearly he's angered Bossman to the point that he's calling out the people now. I don't know what has happened here. Scott Steiner, what's he saying now? You're delusional if you think I'm going to bow down to you. In fact, you should be bowing down to me. Everyone knows I am the best all-round superstar in the WWE. There's nothing you, oh, the BCW, sorry. And there's nothing you, you or the BCW guys can do about it. Well, 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 he's no bound to no man, Shane. Scott Steiner clearly... Struck a nerve in boss man. It's funny to me how people don't take me seriously around here. I work hard, I have great matches, and I win. Yeah, no respect. No respect! I'm going to make people respect me, even though that means beating everyone. I do mean everyone on the roster. 
I will beat respect out of them. That's how I'll prove my greatness. I mean, you gotta start winning matches. We've not seen you win a match yet, but just saying. It's got Steiner. I don't know if you realize this, but it takes more than a big mouth to make it in the BCW. And while you might have the biggest mouth on the block, you don't have what it takes to go to the distance. So why don't you go backstage and cool off? Steiner saying he doesn't have what it takes. Maybe hard times are coming for Scott Steiner if he keeps this up. What does Boss Master say to that? Sorry, I think you misunderstood what I was saying. I was offering the match as a barter. I was laying down the way things are going down. You don't have to like it, but you have to accept it. Ooh, he's saying when they mate, when they face off, he's gonna beat the respect out of Steiner, and he's gonna win that match. He's saying how it is. What does Scott say about that then? What do you say about that, Scotty? Oh wait, what's going on here? Is he had enough? I don't know what's going on. Oh, big headbutt! That's what's going on. Oh, boss went did not like that one bit. We're about to have a fight, people. A big old brawl to end the episode here. It's boss man and Steiner. Guys, we have to go off the air. I can't keep you on for long. What are you guys doing? Oh, big back body drop from boss man. This may be retribution revenge from last week where Steiner attacked boss man. And now boss man. Not falling for Steiner's tricks anymore. Irish whip and oh, ran to trouble. Snap it from Steiner. He's coming back here. Oh, reversal from boss man. Hold on a second here. We got with the Lariat. Steiner. Oh, nice. STO. Steiner back up. Brings him back up. And the kick to the gut. Big old lip. Big old punch to the back there, son. Oh, Gorilla Press. Look at the strength from the big booty dad. Oh, my God. He's making it look easy. That's difficult. That is difficult to pick up a man of that size. Lariat to finish it off. Steiner wins this exchange again. He's had the last laugh once again. These two are going to brawl at some point during the BCW in the next few weeks of TV. These two are going for it. This has been the episode. Five star seven, apparently. Thank you, guys. But that's going to do it for BCW this week. Stay tuned next week. We'll have the matches for you. Uh, let's see what happens on that one. But until then, see you guys next week. Peace out. Have a good one.